Okay, now we're doing, um, okay, so I found my, okay, this is, we're doing the uh, gay tarot. I found my sun tarot deck. Okay, so we're doing the 2023 all signed singles, okay, using gay tarot deck, and we're finding out clues on a future soulmate 20 for 2023. All right. So this came out in the Taurus reading. I, I'm going to um, post it, but just in case uh, it's meant for here, I'm going to show that. Okay, so I'll put that there. and Hopefully I'll remember. Okay, now what we're doing is we're trying to find out clues. So this could be like initials or names or uh, and use your spidey senses. Okay. Okay, so I'm getting meeting someone at uh, some sort of um, gathering. Okay, like uh, this could be a pride. Uh, something like that is coming together. Okay, so um, someone with love. I got handsome lad. Okay, so someone who's handsome. Someone who lights up the room when they walk in. Okay, so for someone, you're aware that this person uh, is into you because someone has uh, been like the messenger and brought you that message. Okay. Okay, so this is going to be like a budding uh, blossom. Okay, and I'm getting like cat energy. Okay, so that could be like what? Venus is in uh, Sagittarius maybe. Sagittarius. Oh, Sag. Okay, so SAG, that's acting, right? Awards, some awards, uh, that might be you getting an award. Okay, so it might be some event like that, some award ceremony where you meet someone. Okay, or get their number at least. Okay, now someone who likes pugs, dogs. Okay, all right, so there's that. Nine of Wands. Okay, so it's like get out and date, right? And I feel like what you would be happier with is to go beyond just the physical and see this is a hierophant. So if you want deeper relationship, what it's suggesting is do something... Um, It's like play the f date, okay, but um, go beyond the physical. So start with something that is not a physical connection. That's what I'm getting. Like start out something. Okay, we're adults though, right? We can do what we want, but that's on the bottom. And I feel like it, for some of you, this is um, bossing up matur maturity-wise. Okay, so... It's like, for some of you, it's like coming of age energy, it feels like. It's like coming from like the 20s to the 30s or 30s to the 40s or 40s to the 50s, something like that. That's It's feeling like uh, what is that? DNA markers I'm getting. Okay, so it might be scientist. Okay, and six of pinnacles. So there could be some past life connection here. Okay. 
There could be an age difference here also because you got the Nine of Wands on this side and an Emperor on this side. But I feel like the clue, key is, is to build the relationship first, then get physical. All right, now that might be easy, harder, might not be easy. Okay. Could be a water sign. Some of you are like, no way, don't bring me a water sign. I just <laughs> had problems with that one. <laughs> okay, all right, so let's see. Yeah, that goes with that. Okay. That could be subconscious too, right? Six of Pentacles, wanting to give to it in the physical, but under, okay, that's like, see this, on the surface, in the physical, showing like you, you are into it, but not willing to give to it on a deep level, emotional level, see, that's why those two are coming up, okay, so you have to be willing to go deeper, yeah, see, Ace of Wands reversed. That's what I feel like it's calling for, is not just the physical, but going deeper. Love's deep ocean. Yeah, woo, and positivity. Okay, so it could be a Leo. Ooh, if it's a water sign, it could have been... Okay, so if you're with a Cancerian, right, and you're Capricorn, that's your polar opposite energy. So if you harmonize with that energy, it might be easier if you've been having problems with that one. Okay. And then you'll see your ships coming in. Okay. What is this? Eight of Pentacles. Because there is this the workability here. Wanting to... Okay. Yeah, if you felt like you've been dealing with some kind of... Yeah, I feel like with the water sign, you may there may be a return here, okay, in 2023. Now, that could just be a symbol of the water rabbit for a year of 2023. So, I feel like that could be, oh, okay, because rabbits uh, symbolize um, abundance, right? And... They could be uh, getting busy, if you know what I mean. <laughs> okay, so it's just saying, uh, see if you can uh, develop a relationship before the physical. And that way, I feel like you uh, it won't be, it's like you could stay out of your head and the investment it's like investing in the relationship. Herald of Cups. Yeah, it's, that's what I'm getting. Herald of Cups and Six of Cups. So with the water sign, you may, that's, that may be where you want to go for some of you. Okay. All right, now. But the love potential is here, so that's what I feel like it's it's calling for. Making that soul connection before the physical connection. Now, let's see. Let me move this up. All right, let's see. We are on Capricorn. Let's get 2023. Anyone who wants... Okay, I haven't even finished and they're falling out. Okay, so some people are right here. Abella and Giraffe. Okay, so someone who's seeing into the future with you. Okay. And Magician. Could be someone with a long neck too. I got Magician. Someone who is in their power and magical. Magically delicious. I got. Okay. Woo! All right, what is all this flying out here? Okay. Now, I just got... Oh, wow, look at this. They're just flying out. Okay. 
By the way, I am wearing the smile you gave me. Okay, so future messages. Ooh. I need you like a heart needs a beat. Okay, so it might be some a doctor. That was coming up in some other readings. Okay, but there's that. Okay. Author. Okay. All right. Train. Okay, so that might be like one of those fancy train rides, you know, like the Orient train or something. Funny. Someone who's funny. Tracy. Kylie. So I feel like some of you are going to meet through friends. Okay. Ole. Animal lover. Balance. Cabin. Ooh. Okay. Artist. And Connor. Okay. Anything else? Woo. Okay. DJ. Hey, Mr. DJ. Okay. So DJ. That could be a name, too. Detective. Woo! Okay, so you might want to do your detective work, right? Before you get together with someone. <laughs> Samantha. I got Sam with that one. Okay, so I got someone who has a name but then has another nickname. Okay, got that. They don't go by their regular name. All right, so this will be it here. Metro. So one of those Metro fancy um, dressers. Sheepdog. Okay, Jonathan. Let's move this back down. Caleb. Science. Scientist. Kimberly. Kim, they go by Kim. Ranger. Okay, I got Power Ranger with that. <laughs> okay, so might be someone who likes that. Um, might be a, a outfit or something. Might be like one of those. Yeah, I got I got Power Ranger from that. Okay, Jack. And they have what primary colors? They were primary colors. Okay, Jack. Woo, panda. Okay. Leah. Okay, so that might be a panda totem for somebody. Okay. Movie. Yeah, someone who is, that's like an, a movie invitation. I would go. Okay, is that a Chinese theater? Okay, let's keep going. Joshua Thomas, biologist. Okay, so scientist. Virgo, cold, from a cold country. Okay, love never gives up. Woo! So it might be someone you already know, and then singer. All right, so let's get one of these. Okay, the singer might just be someone who likes to sing in the shower. <laughs> okay, all right, so love is the same. As like, except you feel sexier. Love and shrimp. Okay. You kiss me with your kiss. My life begins. Your spring. So back here I'm getting like, it could be like two different. 
yeah, age difference or like even size difference, something like that. Someone really tall and someone shorter, maybe. You kiss me with your kiss, my life begins. You're spring to me, all things to me. Don't you know your life itself? Nina Simone, wild as the wind. Ooh, might be an air sign. All right, and I feel sometimes like I have a map in my pocket that folds up and I pull it out and it's bigger than the table and there's a thousand places to go with her. Tom Waits. Okay, so that's like following your inner GPS. That's what I'm getting with that. Okay, and that's going to lead you right to your person. Okay. I leave you with that.